Hello Virgos, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing a general reading for March 2024. Let's see what's going to happen for you, Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising or Venus, Science Plus. Cross watchers can watch this read. Person readings, white spells and premium charge crystals. Reach out on WhatsApp and Instagram and email. Virgos, I see the messages here. Wow. I feel like there's a new job opportunity, a lot of money coming in and a new relationship offer after a breakup. You were feeling really sad and stressed out and you wanted someone to give you that you know kind of respect that you deserved i feel the time has come where someone is coming in with this major commitment offer i feel like the connection someone that's coming towards you wants to ground this connection that means they are thinking about a long-term thing here they could be a libra they could be a leo this person has a strong bond towards you okay they have a strong bond towards you this is someone that is getting obsessed with you. Who is this person that's getting obsessed with? They could be a Capricorn. Virgo. Oh, now I get it. You are the one that needs to... Okay, so there's someone from the past that is getting obsessed with you because we have the King of Cups. And then this is uh, adjoining the Devil card. King of Cups and the Devil card and this says that you have broken away because you know it hurt you a lot and you had to stop giving importance to this person you broke away from this person you left this person but there's someone from the past that literally mourning over your uh walking away you walked away you moved on they're not okay with it okay there's someone that wants to make a contact this time they want to come with a solid communication it's my dog Okay, this time uh, they want to come with a solid communication towards you. They want to give you what you are asking for in a relationship or in a commitment. Virgo. Wow. Capricorn energy. Okay, the hermit. Virgo, well, you've had a sudden realization that there's more to life than this person, than true love uh, or than love in general. So you're right now focusing on self-healing, you're focusing on spiritual journey, you're focusing on awakening, you're focusing on healing yourself, building yourself, growing. I feel like you've had a sudden realization that I, know, I don't need to waste my time on someone like that. I just want to move on and I just want to live my life alone. So you're in this no contact situation with this person. Sometimes it does affect you. But Virgo, you feel like it's better to be with someone that you have put all your trust into and then later get rejected or later get um, hurt. So you've decided to not uh, give them another shot. Okay, so you've decided to be alone. Yes, you're feeling hurt while walking away from this person, the someone that you walked away from. But I feel like this is someone that is coming with a renewal. They want a renewal. They want to have a relationship with you they're coming with this energy of let's get connected together this person has a huge crush on you they feel strongly bonded towards you this person could be a pisces i feel they want to change the whole game and come towards you more strongly two of pentacles you on the flip side will take a lot of time to give them another shot you're like no um i have been hurt i can't make myself go through all this again so even though there's a part of you that wants to forgive them but then you are also thinking about your own self your future your self-respect your life purpose so a lot of things that come in between where you just get confused like what decision should you be making so i'm seeing you're definitely going for you know growth and success you really want someone that can give you that marriage that commitment that you're looking for until and unless they don't talk about marriage or commitment or someone new doesn't come in you don't want to waste your energy or focus on relationship or just having some fun you're more like okay i'm better being alone than you know being in a relationship ace of swords you do think about this person and more than you, this person thinks about you. They want you. I feel like this person has been strongly thinking about uh, communicating with you their fears and the reason why they did this, what they did, what happened in the past. Four of Swords. I feel like in the past, this person just told you to not 
work uh, i feel like this person told you that they can't work out this connection because they have uh they want to be alone somewhere i feel this person was protecting their heart they just didn't want to fall in love because they knew that uh they have to give up on their freedom they have to give up on the control of their life and give it to you this is something that made them feel like maybe they'll get bounded to uh you for the whole life so that was a fear so for a while i feel they told that they cannot work this connection out so you decided to walk away not come back but now they are coming back for once for once there's a relationship happening over here Virgo I'm definitely seeing a relationship eight of swords and the page of wands a grand union i feel this person wants a union they want a reconciliation but you're like i want to release this you blocked this person recently they are coming towards you from other ways i feel like you made a decision that you don't want to give them another shot you're done you want to start a new cycle where you're just alone and chasing your dreams chasing your goals Oh, please. Yes, you want to change. You're done with this person. You don't want to be with this person. Wow, you're the main person in their life. I feel like this person is changing for you. They just want to tell you that you're the person that they want to be with, and they're ready to do anything that you tell them. Okay, they want to stay with you. They want to be with you. But on the flip side, you're changing. You're moving on because it's affecting you. It's affecting your health. It is. Um, you you feel like it has become so negative for you to be that it can affect your health so it's better that i leave the situation this is what you're doing right now also take good care of your health bubbles you may go through you know little bit of like um sore throat or anything like that anything uh, any little small uh infection so you just uh, prevent yourself just just eat good food home food believe in the impossible i am definitely seeing that this is someone that wants to give a proper proposal towards you they could be an aries yeah they want to be with you this person is coming towards you i'm definitely seeing they're coming towards you and you thought that they will leave you if you stop giving them importance or you thought that this person has forgotten you but the truth is they haven't forgotten you they're coming towards you strongly desperately not leaving any stone unturned it's because you valued yourself you put yourself first and now this person is just getting more and more used to um habitual of you they they want you you're like a love dose for this person you're like a medicine for this person you're a therapy for this person so that is why they want to have that therapy with you you have a lot of options at work opening up you might start something of your own or some of you might shift your job you have highly creative skills and you will be working on your arts and you will be working on your skill set i'm seeing you're going to put your creative side to your work which is going to help you expand and grow your angels are heavily supporting you telling you or guiding you towards your life purpose so listen to it for us Another thing that I'm getting is don't stop. Keep doing what you're doing. You're absolutely at the right place. Now let me see about this person. Yeah, they're manifesting you. They might be also getting prayers done for you. They're not able to let go of you. Virgos, let me tell you that this person is obsessed. And I'm feeling like they have this guilt, strong guilt that whatever they've done, they shouldn't have done that. and now they want you with this energy of let's get back together i'm going to change myself i will improve myself so this person is doing anything and everything to make you want them once again whereas you are following the path towards major success and abundance you have found your life purpose or now you're free to do anything that you want to do in your career to make your dreams come true to manifest your wishes all good things are coming towards you are very happy you're enjoying each and every moment of your life i feel you just don't want to let go of this moment so maybe this person has to wait maybe they have to take an appointment from you all right i see i'm not available see i told you you're not available for this person you're more like doing your own thing you know living by choice and doing things that make you happy judgment 
this person has been thinking a lot about you they'll be like what is this Virgo up to what are they doing are they missing me are they not missing me like this person's gone crazy they might be taking tarot readings they might be doing spells they just want you to miss them okay and it's not happening like you have made the right decision for yourself and it's up to you whether you want to be with this person or not but i suggest you to go slow you never know this person actually changed but you have to go very slow over here it should be more like you are investing your time and energy towards your work instead of this person you are able to discern and know what is right for you at the current moment to do your treasure is at hand you don't know you're a universe yourself you have it all whatever you want in your life you can give yourself that you just all you need to do is train your mind you have to just encourage motivate your mind to think in a positive direction and everything will be yours don't try too hard be patient everything is going to come to you okay you have to go slow one step at a time uh, it's going to come to you breathe relax there is a need for you to take deep breaths meditate and relax right now you're literally detoxifying yourself cleansing yourself from all the negativity all the experiences that you've had so that you can renew and regenerate yourself and feel larger than life again which is what you're going through so i'm definitely seeing you're going larger than life and you know that solo energy you're in it's like a bliss it's like a blessing for you right now you just don't want to talk to anyone or you just don't want right now like to get into a new relationship you just want to breathe you want to heal you want to relax you want to feel good about yourself walking away yes you made a right decision either ways you walked away and this person is now missing your love you started to focus on self-love and it means a lot to you you just don't want to waste this uh, moment uh, by giving it all to this person you want to give it to yourself some of you are 49 or in your 40s or 20s you're in love with yourself and this person is in love with you wow this person is super confused like is this really over or are they going to come back like they're in this energy like they have had, had a sudden slap on their face when you did that and now this person is like in this energy of wow i've never seen some someone acting like a storm like you're like a stormy so you're very stormy you're you're loving you're kind but at the same time you're like a storm when you're disrespected so this person understood your true worth now but they're waiting on you they think that you're going to reach out you're going to unblock them or stuff like that but it's not happening so they're going crazy okay let me see more Virgos, please write down the comment section i'm patient i'm happy i'm in love with myself you definitely are enjoying each and every moment of your life doing you and you have a lot of new opportunities career goals and friendships and relationships that you're going to invest in time in slowly and slowly you will get to the peak of success but you are in no rush you really want to give yourself time you want to be at peace you want to go slow you don't want to go breathless right this is what i'm saying you're seeking patience in life because right now you have gone through a hurting period and you have had sleepless nights and you want to come out of that energy you're trying to build yourself back you're trying to feel good about yourself again you're trying to improve your sleep some of you everybody is fine but some of you are trying to improve your sleep trying to get out of the past uh, trying to unhurt yourself you know uh, making decisions all over again making lifestyle changes all of these things are happening to you right now let's see Virgo from Aries to Pisces your person's feelings for you Aries definitely is obsessed with you cannot stop thinking about you they don't want you to go Taurus feels a strong bond towards you they just cannot compare you with anyone else the Gemini wants a best friendship and then turning into marriage cancer cancer is holding you tight in their life and they don't want to let you go okay they want to grow with you leo leo sees you as a wish come true dream come true they want to be with you they want to end up with you for the rest of their life because you make them smile you make them happy you care for them virgo virgo is chasing you they're in their head they cannot stop obsessing over you libra libra want a relationship now and here scorpio
Scorpio wants a commitment. They want a new beginning. They are thinking that you're the most compatible person that they can think of. They want to share their ideas, thoughts. They have to sit and talk to you. Sagittarius. Na Queen of Wands. Nine of Wands. The Sagittarius is feeling left out. I feel like the Sagittarius has been obsessing over your body. They've been thinking about each and every gesture of yours and they feel like they made a mistake by fighting with you and now they want to correct it because they're intimidated by you. Capricorn. Sagittarius is also obsessing over your pictures. Capricorn is taking a leap of faith to have a new journey with you once again. Aquarius. Aquarius is definitely chilling with their friends but they have some emotions but I feel like this person is very chilled out. Pisces. Pisces right now juggling whether should I call them or they will call me. They're in this confusion. Like this person is like also obsessed. I told you. This person is manifesting you. They could be a Scorpio. Okay. And you are manifesting new love. I'm seeing new love is definitely around the corner. But there's someone from the past that literally wants you right off the bat. I told you. I was not lying. Reunion. You're going to celebrate your life. Okay. Like it's just once. And I feel like you will be joining in events, ceremonies, other people's marriages. You're going to have a lot of fun. You will slay. That's the word that I'm hearing. Old soul. You're an old soul. You're very much committed to you know everything that you give your energy to you're not a person that uh, is ingenuine or that takes advantage of other people so it hurt you really bad when this person was ingenuine but i feel like this is someone that wants to reconcile okay you are way older than your age okay so there's a scorpio around you and then they're having oh if you keep learning or and if you keep learning your skills if you keep enhances working on your skills you will attract a lot of abundance. You will attract prosperity, money, everything that you can think of. Someone's name is Nelson, Nelly, Sneha, Stanley, Ashley. Someone's from Texas, someone's from America, someone's from Sydney, Australia, London, England, uh, Siberia, Siberia, Syria, Sweden. Spain, Italy, France, Singapore, El Salvador, Nigeria, Africa, South Africa, Canada, India, South Sudan, Lebanon. Someone is Lebanese over here watching this. Mason is the word that I'm hearing. Someone's from San Diego, um, Chile, Sri Lanka. I'm also hearing Vietnam, Paraguay, New Zealand, Norway, Nicaragua. All right. This is what I get. So where is the advice? Uh, okay, let me pull the advice for you. Hmm. Time to heal. Okay, it's time for you to shed the skin, start afresh, renew or regenerate yourself before you can take any important decision of your life. I'm seeing you're changing. Your life is changing. Everything is like shifting. I'm also hearing snake. Oh my gosh, this, this is also telling me about snake, S-N. So these are the letters that you or your person has. Okay, another hint. I was also talking about snake. Snake spirit. That means it's time for you to renew yourself. Okay, so... That's it. I hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read. Thank you for your time. Please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to I and I'll see you back again with more stuff. Also, follow my Instagram for monthly updates on horoscopes. And there's much more coming. 
so stay tuned and do subscribe bye